With the recent release of numerous DJI cameras, it can be hard to keep track of things. The latest addition to the DJI Action Camera lineup is the Osmo Action 4, which made its debut in August 2023. Currently, rumors indicate that the upcoming model will be the Pocket 3 expected to hit the market within a few months. In this video, we're going to cover all the available information about the DJI Pocket 3 and discuss the potential release date. Back in March 2023, we talked about the potential design of Pocket 3. The design patent illustration of the DJI Pocket 3 provides insights into its features. Notably, the device's rear sight incorporates just two buttons while the camera section has undergone notable alterations. Evidently, it now showcases a square camera module, reminiscent of the configuration seen in the DJI Action Camera Module. The patent also hints at the possibility of a screen on the back of the camera module which implies that the DJI Pocket 3 might adopt a dual-screen design. However, the specific advantages of this dual-screen setup remain unclear at present. One potential use could involve the two screens displaying different forms of content. Although this is just speculation the necessity for a larger screen on the Pocket 3 is evident. DJI might consider repurposing the compact screen from the DJI Action 2 for this purpose. In the event that the set screen proves too sizable, a recommended course of action would be to enhance the display dimensions by around 50 to 60 units. This adjustment would notably enhance visibility during filming and facilitate focus checks. As we're aware, designs that adopt a modular approach tend to be advantageous given that components can be effortlessly replaced and batteries can be swapped promptly. A key attribute of action cameras like GoPro or the DJI Action lies in their integrated waterproofing capabilities. Therefore, it would be highly desirable for DJI to extend waterproofing to the forthcoming Pocket 3 model as well. Now, rumors and reports about the DJI Pocket 3 suggest some exciting upgrades are in the pipeline. It's rumored that the new model might boast a larger lens, potentially integrating the 1 inch sensor from the Mavic Air 2. While this could lead to a slight increase in both size and weight, it seems like a reasonable trade off for enhanced portability. Furthermore, there is talk of an extended dynamic range of around 13 to 14 stops, a significant improvement that would offer better color grading options. If the camera also moves up to 10-bit colors, it could open up the possibility of capturing genuine HDR videos. This is particularly enticing given the surge in popularity of vertical videos on platforms like TikTok, Shorts, and Reels where portrait mode footage dominates the scene. One intriguing departure from its predecessor, the Pocket 2, is the potential inclusion of a swappable battery in the Pocket 3. This innovation holds immense appeal, especially for those who require uninterrupted recording over extended periods. A modular design featuring a removable battery could be a game-changer allowing users to effortlessly switch between batteries during shoots. Considering these impressive enhancements, the DJI Pocket 3 could easily become a prized possession for anyone seeking a top-notch handheld camera. The anticipated launch window for the new camera is set for the final quarter of 2023. The pricing strategy will inevitably hinge on the extent of the upgrades and the prevailing market conditions. Given the global concerns surrounding price hikes, this aspect will be carefully scrutinized. Comparatively, the existing cost of the Pocket 2 stands at $349. With this as a reference point, it's conceivable that the introductory price for the upcoming Pocket 3 might fall in the range of $449. This potential increase might appear substantial, yet it aligns with the pattern observed in the price escalations of other recent DJI models. Nonetheless, a crucial factor in maintaining competitiveness is ensuring that pricing remains accessible and appealing to consumers. So what do you think? Share your thoughts in the comments section below. Consider subscribing for more content like this and thanks for watching.